morning it is tuesday and it's almost 8 a.m um i just got up and i'm about to get ready for the day So now that I'm all washed up, we're gonna be making some oatmeal for breakfast. So oatmeal is something I like to eat every morning. It's really delicious in my opinion. I don't always have time to make it, but when I do, it's always a good morning. So I just put in my oatmeal and I'm just getting my oatmeal. So now I want to put in some oat milk. Oatly is what I use. And that should be enough. Um, we can always add more if we find that it needs a little more liquid. So now I'm just gonna like this. So and I start this on like medium high, high, and then once it starts bubbling, we can turn it down to a lower heat. Give it a little stir. Make sure nothing's sticking to the bottom so it won't burn. Okay, and now we just wait for it to bubble. As you can see, it started to bubble a little, so this is when I like to add my other ingredients for flavoring. Cinnamon is something I love adding. I add a lot of this. Cinnamon, and I just use this ground cinnamon from Trader Joe's. And I put a good amount of this. Cinnamon actually has a lot of nutritional benefits. I didn't know that before, but after I found that out, I used even more. <laughs> You can see now it's really starting to bubble. Um, so you wanna make sure to keep stirring so that it doesn't burn. And don't forget to turn the heat down if it starts bubbling too much. The next thing I like to add is honey. So I have my little honey jar and we're just gonna take a nice scoop of honey and drizzle that in there. That should be enough to give that another little stir. Ooh, look how delicious that looks. Turn down the heat if you haven't already. Mine is at sort of a medium low right now. Once your oatmeal has reached this very creamy, thick consistency, and all of the oat milk is pretty much absorbed into the oats. Your oatmeal should be ready. And at this point, I like to add some chocolate chips. I use these sugar-free dark chocolate baking chips from Whole Foods. These are dangerous because they're so good. So I just 
just add a few like that and then I mix it in so that the chocolate bits melt um, and I will turn off my heat at this point. And the oatmeal is ready to serve. Okay, now I'm just scooping my oatmeal into two bowls. I made two servings this morning. I'm also going to wash some blueberries. And I'm going to add a last little drizzle of honey to top it. And lastly, we're topping with my all-time favorite granola. It's from this bakery in New York. Ooh. Just add a little bit of this. And there you have it. This is my favorite granola. It is so good. Look at how beautiful that looks. Like I literally could eat this every morning. Mmm. The chocolate is so good. <laughs>